so now in this video now we will download our data sets of a content okay so for that we will simply open up Google Chrome browser okay there we go and write in here Kaggle and search for it okay as you guys can see and now simply click on this website kaggle.com in here and just simply register with the Google or you can also register with the email so I will go with the Google in here as you guys can see so there we go so now right in here in the search bar we will simply search for the Marvel heroes okay search for it simply so now we will download that data set simply that one Marvel Heroes it basically 1 GB so click on that in here so this is our data set and you guys can also see right in the trend folder with the directories okay there we go and also in the valid as you guys can see okay so as you guys can see right in the trend folder in here it basically contain all the files that which we will use for training our data set okay and now right in the valid okay in here basically these are all the images of the superheroes which we will use for testing of that data set okay and also we will train the model for it okay so right in here it contains all the images and right in the train in here so it contains all the files that we will use okay in our application now we will simply download this simply come here and click on this download As you guys can see it's downloading it will take some time just wait for a while so it's downloaded as you guys can see now we'll be simply click on this show in folder and here as you guys can see so now we will simply extract that here there we go as you guys can see so now let's check it now we will open the train first as you guys can see in here black widow and there is the images for it as you guys can see is Captain America and so on okay and now in here in the valid as you guys can see in here so all the images right in here so now so now open the Google Chrome and we will search for this teachable machine as you guys can see in here okay just search for this okay there we go so now we are about to go and teach our model so simply open this website okay with google.com there we go click on this get started so we are working with the image project so we are about to select this image project then click on this standard image model so now in here we will need some more classes because as you guys can see here right in here there is a black widow captain america doctor strange so there will be eight classes for these okay so let's go back right in here so the first one will be for a black widow okay
let's make this capital in here okay and now so now right in the class 2 there will be a Captain America okay now we will simply add the images okay click on this upload now choose images from your file or you can also drag and drop here so you will go to the download in here there is a custom file we will click on these all files working on it as you guys can see now we will click on this marvel and right in here train and we will simply upload all the images for the black widow just open it okay as you guys can see in here select all control a and then click open okay as you guys can see loading sample it will import all the images of a black widow right in here so guys I will upload all the images for the Captain America, Thanos and Iron Man and so on and I will show you the last result okay as you guys can see in here I have uploaded all the images for the Captain America so now we will need more classes so simply add in here a class okay like this and we will add more so I will show you the last result okay as you guys can see in here I have created all the class and put name in there for all the characters as you guys can see in here Thanos, Spider-Man, Loki, Iron Man, Hulk, Doctor Strange and Captain America okay and also you guys can see the images okay so now we will simply train our model simply click in here train model as you guys can see as you guys can see in here it started and you can also change these according to your choice but I'll leave it as a default okay as you guys can see here it's done now and our model is trained as you guys can see in here model trained okay so now before exporting we will just test it in here okay so simply come here and click on this webcam and change this to file okay so now simply click on this choose images from your file or you can simply drag and drop in here the image okay just simply select any picture in here okay open so it's a tennis we will scroll down and see what they will say as you guys can see in here tennis 100% okay so it's working fine and our model detect that that it's a tennis and it's give us a result with a hundred percent as you guys can see so now we will check for the Iron Man okay right in here just click on this in here go to the model folder now right in the valid open that okay and right in here we will go with the Iron Man and you can choose here whatever you want okay it's loading images okay just wait for it so there we go now we will select this image or you can select any image right in here okay open as you guys can see Iron Man and you guys can see in here Iron Man 86% and our model predict that and give more words to the Iron Man as you guys can see in here it's 86% because it's Iron Man and the prediction for Doctor Strange is 12 because it's not a Doctor Strange okay and you guys can see here Loki it's somehow about to one person I think but the prediction is really low because in here this is the Iron Man okay so the model prediction is high for the Iron Man okay so this means our model is working fine so now we will simply go and export model in here just simply click in here okay and then come here and click on this tensor flow light in here floating point and then simply download my model okay this will take some time just wait as you guys can see here 
it's done and there is a zip file TF light so now just click in here show in folder there we go converted TF light in here just extract that here as you guys can see here they give us that file and that file labels and model okay so now we will simply open these labels as you guys can see here and we will remove that 0, 1, 2, 3 till 3, 7 because we don't need this index number okay and we will only show the name of the Avengers okay just made it like that so it's fine here save it so now we will simply go to the Android Studio and we will create a new directory okay for the assets there we go so now in here right on this get x Avengers we will create a new directory name this as assets okay there we go now we will simply go back right in here and we will simply cut this from here okay go back to the Android Studio in here right in the asset as you guys can see paste it click OK there we go with the label and there we go with the model okay now we will add a picture for the background I have already downloaded from the Google you will simply as you guys can see in here background I will simply drag and drop in here right in the asset refactor there we go as you guys can see and I will provide this asset folder right in the source you can easily download it from there okay so don't worry for it so now we will simply close this okay now we will simply go back to the home and that's it for this video and we will start working right in the home in the next video okay